Sherehe ya uzinduzi rasmi ya kozi ya ukaguzi wa kadet imefanyika leo hii katika chuo cha polisi cha Kiganjo huko Nyeri. Mafunzo hayo yatakochukua muda wa miezi tisa na tawawezesha waitimu kupata ujuzi hitajika wa kuwa makamanda na viongozi katika huduma hiyo. And in the history of the National Police Service that we are now training direct entry inspectors graduates who are being trained to be commanders and leaders in the National Police Service. Huku ikiwa kwa wazi kwamba hakuna afisa yote yule atakayepewa cheo katika hudma ya polisi bila kupata mafunzo hayo. So today we start a journey. In the next five to six years, there will never be in Kenya senior police officers at the rank of inspector or commanding police stations and above who have not been trained through this cadet officers program. Ni kwenye hafla hiyo ambapo waziri wa usalama ndani Daktari Fred Matiangi aliweka wazi kwamba marekebisho mbalimbali yatatekelezwa katika hudma kitaifa ya polisi ili kuona kwamba hudma hiyo imeboreshwa. We are looking into coming up with regulations and we have agreed with the National Police uh, 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 Commission that we will look at the service standing orders afresh and strengthen this arrangement. Mabadiliko yatakokabiliana na kuongezeka kwa visa vya dhulma kijinsia miongoni mwa maafisa wa polisi we cannot look away anymore and not address some of the challenges we have had in the security sector where you know especially our female members of the service some of them have complained about sexual harassment some of them have complained about mistreatment vile vile waziri matiangi ameharamisha uhusiano wa kimapenzi kati ya maafisa wa polisi you are officers we do not expect you to live here and go to have affairs with your constables whom you are managing huko akieleza kwamba hudma ya polisi haitaruhusu uhusiano wote ule wa kimapenzi kati ya afisa mkuu na mdogo wake senior police officers who opt to have affairs and relations with the junior police officers na iwapo basi moyo utapenda kiukweli pasipokuweza kuzuia hisia itabidi afisa mmoja ajiuzulu kutoka hudma ya polisi ili uhusiano huo uweze kufaulu and they want to marry them one of them has to leave the service we cannot continue this way this has, is breeding in discipline in the service and causing harassment on some of our police officers hata hivyo matiangi ameweka wazi kwamba hatua hii mpya haitawahusisha waliofunga pingu za maisha tayari we will draw the line at this point we will not touch or affect those who are already married in the service across ranks but ig and chairman we agreed with you that we will draw the line at this point tangazo hili linajiri wiki chache tu baada ya afisa mmoja wa polisi aliyekuwa kwa ofisi ya waziri matiangi kumuua mkewe kwa kumpiga risasi na kisha baadaye kujitoa uhai uh, pull up your socks and tighten your belts we are now beginning a phase of very very stringent changes in the service and in the manner in which we go forward we will not have a police service where some of our members feel mistreated some of our members feel uh, treated uh, as less of human beings ni mwelekeo uliozua hisi mbalimbali mitandaoni ikitarajiwa kutekelezwa mwezi Julai ili kuona kwamba hudma ya polisi nchini imeimarishwa nikiripotia runinga kak jina langu ni faith kaulu